Hi friends, once again I am here in front of you with a new video on the topic plague. In this we are going to see the introduction part, epidemiological factors, how the plague is getting transmitted, incubation period, clinical manifestation that is nothing but sign and symptoms, diagnostic test, complications and management, prevention and control we will be seeing. If you like this video, share as much as possible and kindly subscribe my channel that will motivate me to make more medical video for you all. Let's begin our video now. Plague epidemic has been a cause of many death in the world. This is also called black death. The bacteria responsible for the diseases Pastorella pesti. This spread through the bite of a flea and which get the infection from a sick rat. Fleas are found on rats Plague is fatal disease and it has occurred as endemic. Epidemiological factor. Bacterials are found on wild rodent like rats, carnivorous animal and in other small animal where they make their shelter. In India, source of plague is wild rodent. The fleas live on rat are the main source of plague. Along with infected rats and fleas, pneumonic plague patients are also responsible for the spread of disease. Plague affect all age group and both the sex. Disease spread more in winter season. People coming and going, migration spread the disease condition. Plagues are transmitted in the following way. Bite of fleas infected by plague virus come in direct contact with the tissue of the infected animal. Droplet infection from patient suffering by pneumonic plague. Incubation period. Depending upon the type of plague, based on that it will be 1 to 7 days. Clinical manifestation. There are three types of plague found in human. Bubonic plague, pneumonic plague and septicemic plague. We are going to see about bubonic plague. In beginning, sudden fever, shivering and headache will be there. Face and eyes will turn red in color. Person will be feeling tired. Pain and swelling develop on the limb gland, especially in thighs. Bubonic plague might change into septicemic plague. In bubonic plague, patient may die due to toxicity. We are going to see about pneumonic plague. That affects the lungs. The bacteria are found in sputum and spread through droplet infection. Pneumonic plague is very infectious. Diagnostic test. Smear examination of secretion of gland, fluid and smotum is done. Blood culture and serum examination is also done. Complications. Intensive bleeding, pneumonia, toxics and death is there. Management. We need to do controlling of disease through early diagnosis, notification, isolation. Medication useful for treatment of plague are streptomycin 40 mg per kg of body weight 7 to 10 days. Tetracycline 30 to 40 mg per kg of body weight for 7 days. Sulfonamide also is taken in this plague. Prevention and control. Control of fleas. Destroy rats and rodents. Use plague vaccine to produce resistance for 6 months. Keep close watch on the area affected by plague. It is essential to dispose of patients, sputum, secretions and other related materials. In bubonic plague, patient may die due to toxicity. We are going to see about pneumonic plague. That affects the lungs. The bacteria are found in sputum and thank you for watching my video. I believe you have understood about plague. Smash the like button, share as much as possible and subscribe my channel. That will motivate me to make more medical videos for you all. Thank you.